Our goal is to bring you some of the most amazing travel destinations and tips as you adventure around the globe. So do subscribe to our channel and turn on that bell icon to add amazing new places to your travel bucket list. Without any further delay, let's get started. Number 10. Tromsø. Tromsø, northern Norway's largest city, is renowned both for its large number of wooden houses from the 18th century and for the beauty of its natural surroundings. Most of the city is located on Tromsøya Island, where visitors can explore several fine museums and stroll through amazing forests of birch trees. The Fjellheisen cable car offers visitors amazing views of the surrounding fjords and mountains on trips up Storsteinen Mountain. The Polaria Arctic Aquarium and the Polar Museum are popular attractions located 350 kilometers north of the Arctic Circle in this city. Tromsø is one of the best places to view the northern lights in the world. Number nine, Trondheim. In the northern city of Trondheim, there is something for everybody. Founded in 997, the third largest city in Norway was the capital of the country during the Viking Age and the religious center of the nation during the Middle Ages, making it the ideal destination for those who want to explore the history of Norway. The city abounds with remnants of the past, from Sverresborg, a restored 12th century castle, to the Cathedral of Nidaros, the northernmost medieval cathedral in the world. Number 8. Oslo. Surrounded by green hills and mountains, Oslo, the capital of Norway, is situated in a picturesque location at the end of the Oslo Fjord Fjord, with a multitude of nearby lakes and islands. The region, which is a major economic, cultural and political centre, has a long history dating back over a thousand years. Though innovative and contemporary architecture now houses much of the capital, pockets of old wooden buildings are still found here and there. The city boasts excellent museums and art galleries, as well as its vibrant performing arts scene and packed festival schedule. The Viking Ship Museum is particularly fascinating to explore. Other attractions in Oslo include the Munch Museum, which features The Scream and other works by Edvard Munch, to the Folkemuseet, an outdoor museum that includes more than 150 historic buildings from all over Norway, including a stave church. Due to its many green spaces and forests, Oslo also has various hiking and cycling spots, with the islands of the inner Oslo Fjord home to stunning scenery. Number 7. Sogne Fjord. Nicknamed the King of the Fjords, Sogne Fjord in Vestland County is the largest and deepest fjord in the whole of Norway. Stretching over 200 kilometers in length, it cuts through the west of the country, all the way from the North Sea to the Alpine peaks of Jotunheimen. Overall, the fjord system boasts more coastline than the combined French and Italian Rivieras. The fjord plunges to 1,308 meters at its deepest point, while some branches are much shallower and narrower. Every segment has a special look, feel, and attraction of its own. Nare Fjord is generally recognized as one of the most beautiful parts of the fjord system, even though the scenery is stunning everywhere you go. Number 6. Stavanger. Stavanger, Norway's fourth largest city, lies along its southwestern coastline and is the country's oil capital. It's now one of the most expensive cities to live in and visit in the world, thanks to all the money the booming industry has brought in. While the city and its suburbs are spreading ever wider, Stavanger has been important since Viking times. The district of Gamla Stavanger transports visitors back in time to Scandinavia in the 18th century, while many beautiful wooden buildings can be found along the scenic waterfront of the city. In recent years, Stavanger has become a popular port of call for cruise ships. In summer, its bars and restaurants are full of holidaymakers. The region surrounding the city is also great to visit, with fantastic hiking, climbing and surfing at the nearby beaches and mountains. Number 5. Svalbard Located between the Arctic Ocean, the Barents Sea, the Greenland Sea and the Norwegian Sea, Svalbard is a group of islands. Since 1920, the islands have been under Norwegian rule. Its settlements, far more northerly than any part of Alaska and all but a few of the Arctic islands of Canada, are the northernmost permanently inhabited locations on the planet. The combined permanent population is less than 3,000, nearly all of which is concentrated in the main settlements of Longyearbyen, 
and Berensberg, or Spitsbergen. Svalbard's visitors come mostly to experience Arctic nature at its rawest and most powerful. The islands feature untouched glaciers and craggy mountains, but also amazing wildlife such as polar bears, caribou, reindeer, polar foxes, whales, seals, and walruses. Number four, Jotunheimen National Park. Jotunheimen National Park, covering a huge swath of central Norway, boasts some of the country's most awe-inspiring scenery and landscapes. It is host to several mountain ranges with countless valleys, glaciers and lakes dotted between them, fittingly known as the home of the giants. The park is also the home of Vettisfossen, which is the highest waterfall in Norway at 275 meters or 900 feet. One of the most famous alpine areas in Scandinavia, Jotunheimen is very popular among hikers and mountaineers due to its outstanding natural beauty and plethora of peaks. Of these, Guldepiggen and Glittertind are the two tallest in Northern Europe. Both stand at more than 2,450 meters, with many more of the park's mounts reaching 2,000 meters or more. Mountain lodges and well-marked trails in the area offer visitors easy access to glacier hikes, summit tours, mountain climbing, and skiing. Sparkling emerald lakes and glittering glaciers lie amid its sweeping valleys, while reindeer, elk, and the occasional wolverine can be spotted from time to time. Number three, Bergen. Set in a stunning spot on Norway's west coast, Bergen is surrounded by the spectacular Seven Mountains and is surrounded by several fjords and forests. Once part of the Hanseatic League, it has been an important trading hub and seaport for a long time and is now the country's second largest city. The beautifully preserved Briggen, which lies on the eastern side of Vagen Harbour, is the best place to explore its seafaring history and heritage. You'll find the homes and warehouses of colourfully painted wooden merchants, as well as a few great museums, restaurants and bars. The city has an interesting fortress for you to check out, in addition to its famous photogenic waterfront. Bergen has a vivacious and youthful feel thanks to its large student population. While its bar and nightlife scene is certainly worth delving into, the gorgeous scenery surrounding the city is also lovely to hike around. A quick trip up Bergen's popular funicular is a good way to get orientated in the place known as the Gateway to the Fjords. Number 2. Lofoten Islands Lying just off Norway's northwest coastline, the Lofoten Islands are famed for their dramatic and distinctive scenery, which sees its rugged mountains rise impressively above the sea. Interspersed among its awe-inspiring peaks are secluded beaches, bays, and sleepy little fishing villages. The archipelago is home to picturesque pastures and sheltered inlets, with epic fjords dotted here and there, connected to the mainland by a series of bridges and tunnels. As the surrounding waters are rich with life, one of the primary industries of the Lofoten Islands has long been fishing. Although the archipelago is located well above the Arctic Circle, at about the same latitude as Greenland, it enjoys a relatively mild climate due to the circulation of the Gulf Stream. Temperatures up to 23 degrees Celsius in the summer are not uncommon, although it remains a sub-Arctic destination and the weather changes fast. Besides gazing in awe at the scenery, the islands are also a great place to view the Aurora Borealis. Hiking, cycling and rock climbing around its diverse landscapes are all popular pastimes, as are taking scenic boat trips and whale watching tours. Number 1. Geiranger Fjord Geiranger Fjord, one of the most famous and photographed fjords in the whole of Norway, lies in the Sunmore region in the west of the country. A very popular tourist site with gigantic cliffs, sparkling waterfalls and dazzling blue waters all on show. It boasts breathtaking scenery. It stretches over 15 kilometers as part of the sprawling Storfjorden system with steep mountains and jagged peaks lying on either side of it. Several lovely waterfalls are plunging down its cliff faces, of which Suta and Seven Sister Falls are the peaks of the bunch. The scenic and secluded villages of Gairanga and Hellesilt lie at either end of the fjord. Due to its awe-inspiring beauty, many cruise ships and sightseeing tours pass through the fjord particularly during the sunny summer months. While basking in the scenery from a board deck is a fantastic experience, it's well worth hiking up some of the prominent peaks and plateaus. 
such as Del Snibber or Ornus Vinyan for the incredible views. What do you think is the best place on our list? Which one seems the nicest? Leave us a comment below and make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss our future travel videos. With that, I'll see you in the next video.